Uh, good morning, YouTubers. This is Joel. Um, this is going to be a video on my Matchbox VW collection. Um, over the holidays, I did add some uh, classic ones. Uh, you can see them down, two of them down here at the bottom. And uh, when I get to them, you know, we'll go over them. Um, <clears throat> and in between, I also have a couple classic ones, so I hope you enjoy. Uh, by and large, most of these are modern era, but uh, I really think Matchbox does uh, VW good. So anyway, um, let's get started. So, first one. Plastic base, 62 VW Beetle. Made in Thailand. This is the Mattel. Um, I have no idea what it says on the license plate. So when I review the video, I'll see what it says. But I can't see it. It's that small. I think it's a California license plate. <clears throat> um, really like the wheels on this. And uh, front tampo. And taillight tampo. Of course, you have the uh, license plate. And it's kind of cool because it's got a hitch. So I'll have to find something to tow on that. This was, there was a series of cars um, that had uh, um, Scooby-Doo. And this is the one that represents Vilma. Okay. Um, there was another video I did on the Corvette. And I think it was Daphne on the Corvette. So um, that was with my Corvette collection for uh, Matchbox. Um, Okay, so plastic base. That one has a hook on the back or a hitch. And this is just a plain car. Um, actually, no tampo on the back. No tampo on this one at all. But this one has tampo on the headlights. Okay, so um, that teal version, and I do like the wheels on this. So there's three different styles of wheels. Where are you going? There's another one, Matchbox 2000. So this is from the 2000 collectors. So uh, 17, 18 years old already for this one. Some tampo on the back. I used to have this in a display case in, in my house, in my spare room. Um, I had since taken down the display case, and unfortunately I broke it. Um, here's another one with tampo on the back. And a license plate. I don't know if that says the same thing as the other one. Tampo on the front. So there's two. This was on display in my room. Just tampo on the sides. Um, these are all have plastic bases so far, and it's all the same base, and they all have uh, toe hitches. This is just tampo on the side. It says matchbox in the window. That's kind of cool. This one's nice because it's got some extra tampo. Uh, Matchbox 60th anniversary logo, I think that's what that is. It has a license plate. <clears throat> and some pinstriping on the front, which kind of looks nice with headlights. So that's really cool. Of course, the difference is not only the tampo, but the, the black uh, roof. It looks like it rolls away as a, as a soft top roof. Okay, this is a color changer. I had not um, seen, I had not tested to see how that works, the color changing. I just bought it because I like the tampo, I mean the, uh, the casting. And uh, 
some uh, stuff molded into the back, into the bed. And what are they calling this one again? They call this the crew cab. The Volkswagen Transporter crew cab. Okay. And it's kind of neat because these all have hitches in the back so far. Okay. And in keeping with that, here is another one. Okay, which is the same vehicle with nothing in the back. I think there was a variation where there was stuff molded in the back. And this is just the um, the regular edition. This is not a color change or anything like that. So, um, And I do like the color on this. It's kind of nice. And here's a couple classics coming up. Okay. Um, these are Lesney's. Uh, made in England. And uh, it says number 11 flying bug on the back. So. Don't have any boxes for these, but these were the super fast. Uh, wheels a little bit mm, loose. It's okay. It's for display. And it, it turns. So. I thought this was really neat. <clears throat> Here's a similar one in a different color. But this has a black base. Um, actually, it's hard for me to read. I think this one also is made in England. It is a super fast. Just a different color. Different tampo. And I think that is a tampo. Well, this one, I believe, looks like a sticker. Okay. And it's even got the European style uh, license plate molded in. Okay. All right, so that was a couple of Lesney Classics. <clears throat> Here is a Golf 5 GTI, Roman numeral 5V. Okay, tempo on the front for headlights and the rear. Tempo license plate, plastic base. This is, came out fairly recently. However, the Stamp 2005 copyright on the bottom. <clears throat> Another dare car. I think this is a, it's a metal base. Volkswagen Concept 1. Okay. So this is really nice. Here's the base. Here's a Concept One Beetle convertible Coca Cola Tampo. Right, let me make some room quick here. Fifty seven scale, and it's called Beetle 4x4, and the base is stamped 2000. So it's not from 2000, the ones I have, um, that's just when the, uh, the casting was copyrighted. Okay, so all 4x4s, 
and this one here I really think in looking at it now in this light that I have I didn't really notice the color because I pretty much when I buy these unfortunately I just don't stop to admire them okay and uh, I didn't realize it was this uh, purplish uh, color or light magenta but this is uh, really nice now I think the names on the side here I think they're the designers so MBX is for Matchbox and they have Carlson, Cody, Herolda I think he's working for um, um, Hot Wheels Nail as a designer um, I can't quite see the next one then you have Lopez and Waz so that's kind of nice <clears throat> MBX Off-Road and if you notice, these all have different wheels. There's some variations there, not just in the color. So, the 4x4s are kind of nice. And here we have 152nd scale Volkswagen. I can't even read that. When I review the video, I'll be able to read it. So there it is. Okay, so this is a new casting. I don't mean, well, let me see here. What was the copyright date? Two thousand and eleven or two thousand one? Two thousand eleven. But I just recently got that. Uh, here's the Volkswagen Thing, which is the Type 181. Um, casting's been around since 1974. This one is not from 1974. License plate. Headlight casting. Headlight tempo, I should say. Okay. These two... These are nice. Volkswagen Carmen Gear Type 31. I think this is a Type 14, Type 34, Carmen Gaia. The bases are different. Top one has a casting date of 2008, and the bottom one has a casting date of 2012. Oh, okay, I see, because they are different castings. Okay. I like the top one better. I like that body style. I like it with the rounded edges as opposed to the squared off pieces here. Because the one, the teal one looks like a, uh, a Corvair, but it's not. It is a Carmen Gaia. Okay. And these are really cool. Dragon wheels. Super fast. Lesney. Made in England. And with the rod that comes down to prop it up. Um, this one is also super fast. Um, Ladybug, made in England, Lesney. Copyright 1971. It's got some play wear, but not a lot. I 
think that's a sticker dragon wheels. So, okay, that's it for that side. Let's try and move on to. There's some more Lesney. Folks Dragon. Folks Dragon. I don't know if this was a this one here. I don't know if this one is just missing the sticker or if it actually came like that, but it's in really good condition. So maybe uh, some matchbox experts could let me know whether or not there was a variation with that. <clears throat> All right, so here's a later one because it has a plastic base. And this was made in Hong Kong. Hi-ho silver with cowboy hat. It's got some play wear. Another flip top. And looking at it in this light, it looks like it's two tone the side and the top. It's a 1972 copyright Lesney products made in Hong Kong, so it's a lot later than the other ones. But it has the uh, the rod that suspends it. You can see inside with the big engine. Okay. Um, this one right here is not a uh, um, Volkswagen. Um, it's the Mini Haha. -ha. Basically, it's a Mini, which is an English car. Uh, it's in the wrong case, so, but that's what this is. Should go with my, <clears throat> with my English cases. And the rest of this case is VW Transporters. Okay, so I'll just briefly go through these. Um... 1970, 60th anniversary. Uh, this is for the uh, some alien thing. I forget what, but and you can see some of the uh, the variations. This has like a closed top. This has an open uh, view. Here's a VW Transporter. Matchbox symbol. Again, here's the Scooby-Doo. This one represents Shaggy. So, two VWs representing the uh, Scooby-Doo characters. Here's when they were doing Hero City. Richie's Pizzeria. And here we are back to a closed one. This is Volkswagen. Uh, T2 
bus, 1970. I mean, this casting's not from 1970, but it's a 1970 version, I guess. Matchbox 734 VW. I guess maybe that's it. Okay. Um, this came, I think, in a five pack. This one was also a five pack. I bought this one on eBay. Let <laughs> me have a slight cold. Can't match box. This looks like it's got a little bit of play wear, but its wheels are really in good shape. Transporter, 158 scale. Okay, and the rest of these are different casting design, closed everything, Kevy, or closed metal roof, no plastic up there. Okay, and the windows on the side. So it's a VW delivery van, and this was 1999 copyright. 1999 delivery. There's another. Um, this was uh, with the states, the 50th anniversary, state of Georgia. which is the Peach State. It's kind of cool. I really like the, uh, the yellow. This really stands out as a yellow vehicle. Here's another yellow one. This one I really like. I think out of all of them, this must be my favorite. And this would make a good uh, uh, vehicle for someone with a painting business, so that's uh, appropriate. Very nice. And someone into Dirt biking. Uh, automotive parts would also make a good van for automotive parts delivery. And last one, which is probably my next favorite Bill Rider tires 50th anniversary tampo in the front and the rear and uh, red that really looks like a hot rod red so that's it that's it for my VW collection for Matchbox so I hope you enjoyed it um, please like and uh, subscribe and check out my other videos and uh, Please leave a comment. Tell me what you like, what you didn't like. I appreciate it. Have a good day.